A Voyage Without My Father School Days The Joker Many comedians say that one of the reasons they became funny men or women was to prevent them from being beaten up at school. I was a bit of a scrawny kid and being Jewish and living in the 50s also made me a little bit more vulnerable to being bullied. So to be the Joker in our group was the ideal defence mechanism. However, on one occasion my antics did actually result in me getting beaten up. Not by other schoolboys, but by the headmaster of my primary school in Chayside Southgate. Well, not exactly beaten up, but certainly slippered, a favourite corporal punishment of teachers to their errant pupils. Physical abuse was marginally acceptable at that time. It comprised of being bent over a chair and a plimsoll being forcefully applied to one's backside, stung like hell and brought a weakness to one's knees that lasted for several minutes afterwards. So what was this heinous crime that resulted in this punishment? Well, it started as a dare. Next to the school was a tuck shop, a posh way of describing a newsagent and tobacconist. It was gleefully frequented by schoolchildren looking for a sugar fix or crisp snack following an arduous day's learning. My dare was to drop a stink bomb in the shop grind it under my foot and escape without being detected. For those who have never experienced a stink bomb, it consists of ammonium sulphide which smells strongly of rotten eggs. All went to plan. The shop was crowded, the bomb was dropped and duly ground under my foot. I made my way out of the shop before the noxious fumes would pervade my own nostrils.